Ever wonder how robots are getting smarter and video games look so mind-bendingly real? The answer might surprise you. Today, we're diving into the world of NVIDIA, the $2 trillion company leading the AI revolution with CEO Jensen Huang at the helm. Get ready for a deep dive into the future where machines learn, create, and change our world. Let's go. The rise of a tech titan. Did you hear? NVIDIA, the company that started by making video game graphics super smooth, just hit the big leagues. They're now worth over $2 trillion, joining the ranks of tech giants like Microsoft and Google. But how'd they pull this off? It turns out that their graphics processing chips, the ones that make games look amazing, are also perfect for powering artificial intelligence. AI needs to crunch massive amounts of data, and NVIDIA's chips are the ultimate data-chomping machines. This tech is fueling the AI revolution, and NVIDIA is at the heart of it all. We'll find out more about the mastermind behind this rise, Jensen Huang, the CEO, who believes AI is about to change the world. Buckle up, folks. It's going to be a wild ride. Jensen Huang, a leader in the AI revolution, NVIDIA's developer conference this year was electric. Over 11,000 people packed the stadium. Programmers, tech bigwigs, even excited investors. They were there for one man, Jensen Huang, NVIDIA's CEO. Now, Huang himself isn't exactly a showman. He admits he gets nervous on stage, but you wouldn't guess it from his cool composure. This year, he shared the spotlight with robots powered by NVIDIA technology painting a picture of an AI future. It felt like a turning point, like when Steve Jobs unveiled the iPhone. But Huang wasn't showing off a phone. It was a new graphics chip called Blackwell. The fastest ever, he claims, with everyone from Google to the whole industry lining up to get their hands on it. It looks like NVIDIA, the company that made video games look amazing, is leading the charge into a world powered by AI. NVIDIA's AI engine, powering innovation. Forget regular processors. NVIDIA's AI computer uses a GPU. It can swallow information like a fire hose, crunching quadrillions of calculations per second. That's mind-blowing. And the best part? They're hoping it surprises them. This technology is being used to design lighter, stronger materials, discover new drugs, and even explore space. Jensen Huang, NVIDIA's CEO, showed off some incredible creations at his developer conference. One was a digital Earth that can predict weather 3,000 times faster than a supercomputer, using way less energy. But NVIDIA's AI goes beyond cool gadgets. AI for real-world applications. Imagine creating movie sets instantly with just a few words. NVIDIA's tech is making this a reality. A company called Kubrick uses NVIDIA's GPUs to whip up virtual sets in real time for a fraction of the usual cost. No more expensive pre-production. This is a game changer for Hollywood. Meanwhile, in the medical field, Dr. Alex Snyder is using NVIDIA's AI to design brand new drugs. At first, she was skeptical about AI and drug development, but then she Show saw the, the data. data and it blew her mind. Her team uses NVIDIA's technology to create entirely new proteins, never seen before in nature, to fight diseases like cancer and even COVID. They're basically inventing new medicines with the help of AI. This is groundbreaking stuff. The future of work, humans and robots together. Speaking of pushing boundaries, check out Brett Adcock, CEO of Figure. They're tackling labor shortages with NVIDIA's help. In just 21 months, they built a robot prototype called Figure One, thanks to NVIDIA's powerful GPUs. Without NVIDIA's tech? Forget it. They say NVIDIA's the best in the business for this kind of thing? Pretty impressive. Robots with a human touch. Imagine asking a robot for a healthy snack and it grabs you an orange, not junk food. That's the potential of Figure One, a robot powered by NVIDIA's technology. It can walk, understand simple commands, and even seem to reason a bit. It's still under development, but the results are impressive. This robot is being tested by German car giant BMW, and billions more could follow in the coming decades. Now, some folks might worry about robots taking their jobs, but here's the thing. As AI and robots make companies more productive, those companies make more money. And guess what? 
companies with more money tend to hire more people, so new jobs will likely emerge alongside these robots. It's not about replacing us, it's about working together for a better future. Human judgment in the age of AI. Even with robots on the rise, some jobs will always need a human touch. Machines can't handle situations that require good judgment and understanding of complex situations. Humble beginnings, a dream at Denny's. Speaking of beginnings, check out NVIDIA's headquarters. It's a far cry from their humble beginnings, at a Denny's in San Jose. That's right, 31 years ago, video game graphics were just a dream. A 15-year-old Jensen Huang even washed dishes there. Fast forward to Huang at 30, an engineer with a family. He and two friends, Chris and Curtis, had a crazy idea. Revolutionize video game graphics with a new chip. They hatched this plan right at that Denny's booth. None of them knew how to make it happen, but their dream was big. A new graphics chip to supercharge computers. Their first attempt flopped though, almost sinking the whole company before it even began. From flop to fortune, the rise of the GPU. Nvidia almost went bust in 1996. Their first graphics chip was a flop, but then genius struck. They totally changed course and created a groundbreaking new GPU, a chip that would transform video games. Imagine graphics going from blocky to smooth and realistic. That's what NVIDIA's tech did. It saved the company and launched them into the big leagues. Just eight years after their Denny's meeting, NVIDIA was a major player. But Jensen Huang wasn't done. He set his sights on a powerful supercomputer powered by GPUs, taking them far beyond video games and straight to Wall Street. It was a risky bet, but for AI researchers, it was a game changer. Here's the twist. NVIDIA didn't build this tech for AI specifically. It turns out their GPU architecture was just perfect for it, like a magic key unlocking the potential of AI. This lucky meets visionary moment in 2016 put NVIDIA at the forefront of the AI revolution, buying Mellanox Technologies. In 2019, NVIDIA, the company known for super smooth video game graphics, made a big move. They bought Mellanox Technologies for a whopping $6.9 billion. But why? Well, Mellanox is a leader in high-performance computing. They make the technology that helps move massive amounts of data around super fast. This is crucial for things like AI and scientific research. By buying Mellanox, NVIDIA wasn't just getting better graphics chips, although they are known for those. They were getting a foothold in this whole new world of high-powered computing. It's like buying a key to a secret room full of amazing tech. This move helped solidify NVIDIA as a major player, not just in gaming, but in the future of computing. Shopping spree and supercomputing ambitions. The years 2020-2023 were a busy time for NVIDIA. Here are some key highlights. NVIDIA went on a buying spree, acquiring Cumulus Networks to strengthen its networking business and aiming for a mega deal to buy ARM, a chip designer. This would have been a game changer, but regulators blocked it due to competition concerns. In the midst of the global pandemic, NVIDIA stepped up by developing an open source ventilator design to address shortages. They launched their powerful Ampere GPU architecture and the A100 GPU accelerator, pushing the boundaries of graphics processing. This paved the way for the impressive GeForce 30 series graphics cards for gamers. NVIDIA wasn't just about gaming, they invested heavily in supercomputing, building the Cambridge One supercomputer in England for AI-powered healthcare research, showing their commitment to scientific progress. They expanded their global presence with a new research center in Armenia and a new headquarters building. However, they also faced challenges, with a cyber attack and U.S. export restrictions impacting their business in China. From Denny's to $2 trillion, hold on to your hats. NVIDIA's journey continued with some incredible milestones. They hit a major mark in 2023, becoming a $1 trillion company. Remember, they started at a Denny's booth their powerful H100 GPUs were in such high demand that even tech giants like Tesla were pleading for them. NVIDIA wasn't stopping at graphics cards. Rumors emerged that they were designing ARM-based CPUs for Microsoft's Windows, hinting at their ambition to be a major player in computer processors too. 
In February 2024, NVIDIA became the third U.S. company to reach a $2 trillion market cap. They're now a dominant force in the tech world. They keep pushing boundaries, recently announcing their new AI chip and microarchitecture. The unexpected hero of AI, NVIDIA's supercomputer. Huang, the CEO of NVIDIA, built a revolutionary AI supercomputer. This technology even helped it create the building blocks of ChatGPT. You know, the program you're talking about right now. With AI taking off, Huang became a Silicon Valley rock star. It's a far cry from his childhood as a Taiwanese immigrant who once washed dishes at Denny's. The driven leader, Jensen Huang. Huang himself is a complex character. He's down to earth yet demanding, a perfectionist who pushes his team hard. He believes that achieving greatness requires relentless effort, and it seems to be working. NVIDIA is booming. Investors are crazy about them, but there's a dark spot. Over 600 employees left the company last year. Can NVIDIA keep this incredible momentum going? Only time will tell. The duality of AI. AI is both exciting and scary. Top experts are even warning about potential dangers. It's a mixed bag, right? And you're not alone. You might wonder if AI is amazing or something out of a sci-fi movie, like when a computer takes over. Here's the thing, AI is super fast at calculations, but that doesn't make it smarter than us. The limits of AI, humanity's enduring qualities. AI is powerful, but it can't love, create, or truly understand. These are human qualities. Jensen Huang believes AI will bring a brighter future, not a robot takeover. Let's hope he's right. But with great power comes great responsibility, as they say. As AI continues to evolve, we need to make sure it's used for good. We need to be mindful of potential biases in AI algorithms and ensure they're developed ethically. Here's the thing, AI is a tool. It's up to us, as humans, to decide how we use it. We can choose to harness its power to solve some of the world's biggest challenges, from climate change to disease. Or we can let it run wild and risk unintended consequences. The future of AI is uncertain, but one thing's for sure, it's a future we'll shape together. That's a wrap on the future of AI, powered by NVIDIA's groundbreaking tech. Did this blow your mind? Let us know in the comments. If you want more epic tech insights, smash that like button and subscribe for more. We'll keep you on the cutting edge of what's next. See you next time.